Hello everybody and welcome back to Beanie Boo Safari. Today I'm going to be recreating BooTubers profile pictures. Basically what that means is I'm going to be trying to get as close as I can to getting the same picture as in other BooTubers profile pictures if that makes any sense. Basically the title says it all. Recreating BooTubers profile pictures. And I'm very sorry if I didn't recreate your profile picture and it's probably because I either don't know about your channel or you have a drawing as your profile picture or you have a edited picture or you have a Beanie Boo that I don't have as a mascot or in your profile picture. I am truly sorry about that. I just don't want to be drawing and I don't want to be editing pictures. I just want the plain Beanie Boo photo. Also, if I don't have your mascot, how in the world am I going to make a quite kind of accurate picture of your Beanie Boo mascot? Anyway, this intro is long enough. Let's get into the actual video. So the first BooTubers profile pic that I'm going to be recreating is it's Fossa. Okay, so I've got my dude Linus here, but I see in Fossa's profile pic that Linus has got um, a few piercings. So I'm going to put some earrings on Linus. Yeah. All right, so as you can see, Linus has got two piercings right here and one on his nose, just like Fossa's picture. Now I wasn't quite sure if these were diamonds or balls, so I just put these um, silver balls. Okay, so now Linus is wearing this, um, just like this collar that has these, um, uh, I don't know, metal, <laughs> like uh, diamondy things. I don't know, uh, you guys can see a picture on screen, but um, I don't really have that, but I believe I have some beads, but they're not made into a necklace. Let me go get them. Okay, so after quite a bit of searching, I finally found the beads that I was looking for, and I found a perfect little piece of, um, I don't even know what, that are supposed to go with the beads. So all I need to do is assemble that and put it on Linus. There we go. This is Linus's punk collar. And it was a little bit short in the back, so I just closed it off with a um, safety pin because we won't be seeing the back. So Fossa also has this jacket on Linus, but I don't have anything like that and you can't really see it in the photo. So I'm just going to leave it out because I really don't have anything like that. So now that Linus is all done, I'm going to focus on the background, which is white and it has fairy lights. I have fairy lights and I'm going to hang them up like this and get rid of all of the lovely decorations in the background. Okay, so this is the setup here. I've got some push pins and scotch tape holding these lights up. And we've got Linus. So Girl Meets Pups profile picture has um, Giselle in it. And she's also got this um, sparkly background thing. Like it's kind of like a holographic thing. So I'm gonna see if I can find anything like that. Also, I'm leaving this background up because it's actually really cute. Okay, so the only thing I could find is this flippy holographic pencil case of mine. And I guess this will do. Okay, so the pencil case is actually, now that I look at it, not big enough, so I'm going to also use this matching flippy notebook, so we'll see how that looks. Alright, so this is what it looks like. It looks absolutely crazy, but I, I really like it and it looks great. Alright, so the next Beanie Boo YouTuber on my list is Beanie Boo Twilight, and this one should be pretty easy because it is just a face close-up of just Beanie... no, of, of just Muffin's face. Okay, so let's position Muffin very close to the camera and take a picture. There we go, that is it for Muffin. We didn't even have to change this wonderful sparkly background. So the next Beanie Boo YouTuber I'm going to do is Beanie Boo Dude. Before we do this, I'm just going to take this down. There we go. 
So Beanie Boo Dude's mascot is Slush and he's it's just a picture of Slush with a blurred background behind him. So I'm going to be going outside to do that because I really want it to look like there's actually something behind that's not just white. So we're going outside. Okay, so here I am on a balcony and you can probably hear the cars going by, but um, I'm going to take a picture of Slush and then I'm going to put it through an editor so that all of the things behind him are blurred. There we go, so I took the picture, now let's go back and see. Okay, so the next Beanie Boo is Ocean Lex Studios. I'm extremely sorry if I pronounced your name wrong. So Ocean Lex Studios seems to have root beer in the middle holding an LPS doll with a shell or rock to the side and to either side of him there is a like a marble with a frog in it and a marble with a fish in it. Now that is very specific. I don't think I have all of those. I think I have a few LPSs. I'll see if I can find them. I, I think I have some marbles maybe um, and uh, I'll use a rock because I don't think I have a shell. Well, at least not one that's that big. Okay, so I looked around and I did find this LPS figure and I found a rock, but I didn't find any marbles. So now let's go outside in the grass and take the picture. There we go, that's it. Okay, so the next booktuber that I'm going to be recreating their um, profile picture is Melissa loves ties, and so her mascot is Helena, so I'm going to be taking a picture of her, and it's just, her uh, profile pic is super simple, it's just Helena's face against a white background. Okay, so that was very easy. Now we are going to move on to Beanie Boo Gilbert, which even though Gilbert is his mascot, he has Austin as his profile picture. So Austin is outside, I think either in a brown plant or pine needles. So I'm going to go outside and hopefully not get Austin too dirty because he's white and find some pine needles. All right, so I found some pine needles and we took the picture and Austin is not that dirty. Okay, so the next booktuber that I'm going to be doing is Pablo the Beanie Boo. So I think Pablo the Beanie Boo is simple and very good profile picture as well. It's just Pablo, I think against either a white background or a window of some sort, but I'm just going to use this white background. So yeah. Okay, so the last booktuber that I'm going to be doing is Dream Boo, and they have the mascot Duke, so I'm going to be taking a picture of him. So in Dream Boo's profile picture, it seems to have Duke being held and also a beige sort of, I think it may, maybe a pillow or a blanket. I don't really have anything like that, but I do have cardboard. So I think that that is our best bet, and we'll just use that. All right, so Dream Boo was the last Beanie Boo YouTuber that I am going to be doing. So let's get Safari in here for the outro. There we go. So that is the last Beanie Boo YouTuber we are going to be recreating with their, no, that did not make sense. Okay. Oh, my flower brown fell off. You know what? We're just going to do plain and raw, just like my profile picture, black, black no white floor white walls and no accessories on safari okay 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 sorry you don't get a nice setup or whatever sorry you don't get a flower crown this is how it is anyways okay so i hope you guys really enjoyed um i thank you guys so much for watching all the way to the end please like and subscribe and turn on notifications I, again, I'm very sorry if you weren't included. It's probably because you had some sort of editing or something done to your profile picture. 
or you have a drawing or you just simply have a Beanie Boo as a mascot that I don't have. So I'm very sorry, but those circumstances eliminated quite a few people. So yeah. So anyways, this intro has been long enough and I again really hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in another video. Goodbye.